this video from my bathroom because uh, it's the only room with the door I can lock and in the door to my room I put um, because I can't lock the door to my room, there's no key. Did you know Shikamara's wedding cost $50 million? The princess's recent announcement of her divorce has not only shocked the world, but also sparked debates about royal traditions. But what caused the unexpected setbacks? Let's find out. Shikamara bint Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, who is the daughter of Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the big boss of Dubai, didn't hold her back. Her Instagram post was super direct and aimed right at her husband, Sheikh Mana bin Mohammed bin Rashid bin Mana Al Maktoum, on July 16. She announced her split from her hubby, which is just a few months after they had their first baby. The whole thing went down as an instant divorce, with Sheikh Mara basically asking for a divorce through her social media. Seems like not every royal fairy tale ends happily. For a bit of a backstory, Last year in March, the Arabian Royal Agency spilled the beans on Sheikh Amara and Sheikh Mana's engagement. It even got a shout out from Sheikh Mana's dad, with an official poem congratulating the lovebirds. Fast forward a few months and the couple tied the knot in May 2023, throwing an extravagant reception in Dubai the next month. Sheikh Amara stunned everyone in a white embroidered ball gown by Dubai-based designer Ezra Couture. Their lavish celebration seemed like a match made in heaven but it seems that relations between the pair have soured quickly, with Mara's bombshell Instagram post sending shockwaves across the world. There has also been speculation that the account was hacked, as such public statements of personal lives are strictly taboo for the royal family. However, since uploading the post, which has amassed more than 350,000 likes and nearly 37,000 comments, in repeating the phrase, I divorce you, three times, the princess appeared to be referencing the controversial Islamic practice of triple talaq, it has been banned in many countries including India, Saudi Arabia and Morocco, and traditionally allowed a man to divorce his wife by saying or writing the word talaq, Arabic for divorce, without needing to offer a reason or obtain his wife's agreement. Sheikh Amara isn't the only daughter of Dubai's ruler, Sheikh Muhammad, to challenge royal life. With 26 children from 7 wives, Mara is the only child Sheikh Muhammad has with his Greek wife, Zoe Grigorakos. She graduated from a London university in 2023 with a degree in international relations and is a prominent figure in Dubai's social scene. The UAE royal continuously gives back to the community. She is seen spreading love and spending many afternoons with children of determination. She also shares a photograph of her smiling and hugging a child. Her philanthropic efforts play a major role in raising awareness on societal issues. The princess is also an advocate for women and is known to empower local designers in the UAE by attending events such as the Icons exhibition. In May 2023, Mara and Sheikh Mana held a lavish wedding reception at Zabil Hall in the Dubai World Trade Center and honeymooned in the luxurious Greek island of Mykonos. The Dubai princess had also shared a video recapping the wedding, which gave followers a closer look at all the intimate details of her important day. Other than that, the newlyweds haven't been spotted together again until they shared an exclusive image on her Instagram from her first public outing with her husband. The royal couple were seen at the Jabal Ali Shooting Range Club. This indoor and outdoor shooting club offers archery, clay pigeon and target shooting practice, making it the perfect option for an adrenaline-packed day. The club is situated at the five-star beachfront destination Jather Resort. According to some sources, the royal couple was spotted at a dining spot where they posted a photo of themselves in front of the restaurant and a video showing the view of Dubai Mall from the terrace on their Instagram account. Later in October 2023, the couple announced they were expecting their first child, sharing an ultrasound photo on Instagram with the caption, Just the three of us. They revealed the news on October 18. It's clear that Mara's life is filled with high-profile moments and royal drama. Seven months ago, Sheikha Mara graced the cover of Harper's Bazaar Arabia, making waves in a society where public photos of women, especially without head coverings, are a huge no-no. Some think her mixed heritage might be why she's breaking with tradition. Emirati political commentator Abdul Kalak Abdullah mentioned that Mara, who doesn't exactly fit the local mold, comes off as quite liberal. Abdullah also pointed out that Mara's recent Instagram post about her divorce is a major breach of royal conduct and social norms in such a private society. On a lighter note, Sheikh Amara's 30th birthday in February was celebrated with a pink-themed gender reveal, announcing they were expecting a baby girl. Later, she also shared the happy news of her daughter's birth on May 9th, 
with a sweet Instagram photo of the baby's tiny hand. On June 4th, Sheikha Mara's Instagram post hinted at trouble in her marriage with Sheikh Mana. She shared a photo of herself holding their baby with the caption, Just the two of us, which raised eyebrows. Eventually, by July 18th, Mara had removed all pictures of her husband from her Instagram, fueling speculation about their relationship. Sheikh Amara's dramatic Instagram post is far from the first time the Dubai royal family has been in the headlines in recent years. Mara's father, Sheikh Mohammed, has 26 children with at least seven wives, having divorced all but his first wife, Sheikh Hind bin Maktoum al Maktoum, which is known as the most expensive royal wedding ever in 1979. They celebrated with a week of festivities, including a five-day public holiday. Around 20,000 guests attended, and a new stadium was built for the occasion. Bejeweled camels were sent to the stadium to entertain guests and deliver gifts. The Dubai royal family has a history of drama. Sheikha Latifa's escape attempt in 2018 and Princess Haya's 2020 legal battle with Sheikh Mohammed over similar issues have put the family in the spotlight. In 2018, Sheikha Latifa, Mara's sister and another princess, tried to flee Dubai. She used an inflatable boat to reach a yacht in international waters rented by the French. But while off the coast of India, the boat was intercepted by Indian commandos, and Latifa was forcibly returned to Dubai. For months, her whereabouts were unknown until she smuggled out videos claiming she was held in solitary confinement. When I'm released, um, every day I am worried about my safety and my life. Um, don't really know if I'm going to survive the situation. Uh, the police threatened me that I'll be in prison my whole life and I'll never see the sun again. Sheikh Mana is also a businessman with ventures in tech and real estate. His Instagram is full of snaps with celebrities like footballer Ronaldinho and sports stars such as Novak Djokovic. Despite being relatively private, Sheikh Mana's public Instagram reveals a controversial side. He's posted twice with Andrew Tate, a self-styled misogynist who was arrested last year on charges of human trafficking and running a criminal gang to exploit women, which he denies. In October 2022, Sheikh Mana shared a series of seven photos with Tate in Dubai, using hashtags like hashtag Andrew Tate and hashtag Top G. He also posted a video of them dining together. Tate, who's faced severe criticism for his misogynistic views, like claiming women belong in the home and are a man's property was charged in June 2023 with rape, human trafficking, and forming a gang to exploit women. Finally, Sheikh Mana and his father, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, haven't said a word about the Instagram drama. The Dubai government media office also hasn't replied to requests for a comment. This is a rare peek into the usually perfectly managed private lives of Dubai's royals. It's part of Sheikh Mohammed's efforts to make Dubai the UAE's top tourism hotspot and a major finance center. Here's a thought to wrap it up. Could Sheikh Mara's shocking Instagram post signal a bigger royal problem? Don't forget to comment down below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe.